guys, I'm sure you all remember Lil Tay. Y'all ain't doing nothing like Lil Tay. This is why all y'all fucking haters hate me, bitch. This shit cost me 200,000. I'm only nine years old. Your favorite rapper ain't even doing it like Lil Tay. So I just wanted to make this video today because the truth is finally out. Lil Tay is not who you think she is. She out here trying to be youngest flexor of the century. You already know what it is. Lil Tay the youngest flexor of the century. But she's not. She's flexing other people's shit and recently got exposed for it. Wait, wait, wait. That's not her money? That's not her car? That's not her house? Lil Tay, I'm feeling a little betrayed. I ain't got no license, but I dropped 400 racks on this car. Bitch, y'all don't even have a car. I ain't got no license, but I be driving this around. I bought this car, bitch. Y'all saying I rent my cars? Bitch, hell no, I don't rent my car. more than your car. That's probably true. That's a $400,000 car. That costs more than my house, bitch. <laughs> y'all ain't doing it like Lil Tay. This is why all y'all ears hate me. Lil Tay's videos are crass. This car cost me $130,000. Most of them revolve around cars and cash. See, it makes you wonder, where's she getting all this stuff from? Who's behind the camera? Like, this don't add up. <laughs> Posts from the nine-year-old striving to be the next YouTube and Instagram sensation recently got her mother caught. I pray a strong gust of wind comes and like, that money goes flying. How's somebody gonna like walk past all this money and not like rob her ass? As a nine-year-old, I'm pretty sure anybody could take a nine-year-old. So here is the plot twist. So little Tay just got her mom fired. Her mom is the one that is behind all of this. All those flexing videos, her mom was recording them. Y'all remember this video when she was flexing her apartment? This Lil Tay, let me tell y'all something. This shit costs more to your rent. My toilet costs more to your rent. Everything in my bathroom costs more to your rent. And see, this is my closet. Everything in here be designer. Gucci, Louis, Versace. So Lil Tay's mom is actually a realtor in Vancouver. She has access to all these nice ass houses. And then she got an idea. Like, hey Lil Tay, you wanna be rich and famous like bad baby? Why don't you just be a little piece of shit for me? I'll record it. You put it on Snapchat, Instagram, whatever. And they're recording these Instagram videos in the houses that her mom has listed for sale. Yeah, y'all don't see a problem with that? <laughs> like imagine if I hired her mom to sell my house and my house was vacant. And we got this little ass kid making videos in it with her mom recording her. Like over here, you have her mom standing right behind her in the video. She's like, okay, honey, there's a mirror. You can record yourself right here. I'm trying to stay positive. So get your money up before y'all hate. All right, I got my money up. Check my PayPal, check my bank, check my social blade. So I can hate, right? So that's her mom. She keeping a lookout. Like, okay, Lil Tay, I'm gonna let you flex in public real quick. I'm gonna I'm keep a watch out, all right? Lil Tay just copped a brand new Ferrari. Damn, don't slam that so fucking hard. Rude. You haven't seen this car in your lives. I'm out here flexing and all y'all broke ass haters. I got a $350,000 chain. Y'all haven't seen this in your lives. I'm richer than all y'all broke ass haters. Y'all grown ass men hating on me because y'all broke and jealous. Y'all rappers out here, I ain't even started rapping yet, but I'm richer than you, bitch. I like how the dog just chilling. Plot twist, the Rari belongs to the dog. He's just chilling. He like, okay, I'll let you drive it around. If you drive me around, take me for a snack. So this is how they found out Lil Tay's mom was behind everything. Somebody actually emailed Lil Tay's business email and asked to get on a call with her manager. They gave her the manager's number and then they googled the number. Lo and behold, her mom comes up. 
her mom, which is a realtor in Vancouver. It's the same phone number. And if you go to a realtor's profile, you can see the houses that they have listed for sale. And guess what? It's little Tay's house. This new mom kitchen, it's bigger than your whole entire living room, and I got four more houses. She got four more houses. No, her mom got four more houses to sell. This shit costs more to your rent. My toilet costs more to your rent. Everything in my bathroom costs more to your rent. And see, this is my closet. Everything in here would be designer. Gucci, Louis, Versace. It's funny because it's not hers. It doesn't only cost more than my rent. It should cost more than your rent. It ain't even your house. Is it even flexing if it's not even your shit? She's literally flexing other people's houses, other people's cars, other people's shit. It gets better though. Her mom's manager exposes her. The one that she did was in the, uh, the bathroom. That is one of our colleagues uh, home on the market. So this dude is her mom's boss and he saw the videos and he calling her out. She was apparently doing an open house. David Yang was Angela Tian's boss. His red Mercedes SL500 also used as a prop in one of the profanity laced <laughs> posts. Then she took her mom's boss's car. You even asked this guy for permission? Like what the hell? I didn't realize she was filming for Instagram. <laughs> Car real quick for a picture. Her mom chilling behind the camera like, yes, yes. Said I wouldn't make it, but look, I'm verified now. Social media experts say the problem is when parents push their children to act this way on social media, it pays off. Damn, imagine your parents making you do this shit. Like Lil Tay was probably a nice little girl before all this, and then her mom created this demon. And views can translate into actual cash. While Little Tay can be considered a child actor just being given a script, this online character could be tough to shed when she's older. You telling me she gonna be 30 and still flexing on people? <laughs> it is acting. It's it, And the hard part here becomes when something negative does happen, you see a lot of those YouTubers start, try and separate the personas they have online from their actual person, and it becomes very hard to do. Bitch, it ain't hard to do. Like Little Tay in real life, she a whole different person. I was, oh. Are you oh, making okay. a video? Yeah. Oh. She like a regular kid. <laughs> Ooh, dove. She ripping. She ripping dove. Money. <laughs> money, money. She ripping doves. <laughs> bitch really ripped up a $20 bill? Why would you rip up money? You need to start saving up. So one day, you can buy your own house and stop making videos on other people's. Y'all don't have that view, and I'd be holding your mama's rank. The consequences for Lil Tay's mom a lot more immediate. With the writing on the wall, she resigned from her job. She called and she said, I'm quitting from real estate. So her mom got busted. They're like, what the hell are you doing? And she's like, oh shit, you know what? I, I'm quitting. I'm quitting. Bye. Sorry. You'll never see me again. I don't know if she quit out of embarrassment. Like, ah, shit, they caught me. I hope Lil Tay can support her and her mom now. Y'all gotta start making some real money. This video posted just a day ago, it seems Lil Tay's mom is making a career change to her full-time manager. <laughs> so, this whole time, it was her mom. Her mom was behind it. So she quit her realtor job because she got caught. Man, I would've just quit out of, like, shame. Like, they really making these videos in people's houses, in her manager's car. Her poor mom probably cashed her entire paycheck just so little Tay could flex it in a video. I got money on my line. Bro, I don't understand why people saying our money is fake. As you see, this is not counterfeit. You dig what I'm saying? But hey, sis, tell me what up. Yeah, it might not be fake, but it's like hella ones and then like a hundred on each side. Y'all even touch as much money in your lives. Y'all only hate it because you broke ass hoes. Hmm, maybe I never touched that much money in my life because I use a debit card. I don't like to touch money. Lil Tay, you do know where half those ones came from, right? Uh, seriously though, who the f*** is gonna carry around that much cash? You are begging to get robbed. Anybody else walk around with that much cash? They're asking to get robbed. Like, please, beat my ass and take my money and if she didn't have like hella people around her at all times i'm pretty sure there are a lot of people that would hit a nine-year-old <laughs> and take their money <laughs> let me tell all y'all something right now bitch i'm only nine years old but i'm richer than your grandma uh my grandma's dead so yeah that's something you got right you are richer than my grandma man look at this view 
This is all self-made, bitch. Thank God. I'm only nine years old, but I bought an $8 million mansion. <laughs> Guys, I didn't know you could be nine years old and buy an eight million dollar mansion. Like what was I doing when I was nine years old? I was in school and then I'd come home and watch Yu-Gi-Oh! and play Yu-Gi-Oh! And she out here buy eight million dollar mansions. I wonder if anybody could do that. Just like go into a mansion and be like, yeah man, look at this shit. I just bought this ten million dollar mansion. Hell yeah. You know what's funny? Realtors won't even like take you to expensive houses unless you get pre-approved for a loan. You have to have proof that you have enough money just to go see the house. But she got her mom. Her mom is a realtor, so she got the hookup. So yeah, that's basically it. Lil Tay, she got caught. On Honestly though, I think this whole thing is funny. I think the whole thing with her and her mom is funny. It's all meant for entertainment. I don't know guys, she's just out here trying to spread positivity. I'm trying to spread positivity. You broke ass hoes. But yeah, comment below. Tell me what you guys think. If y'all think Little Tay got what she deserved, make sure you hit that like button in the face. And subscribe to the Wolfpack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.